Hello trader, welcome to another weekly forex forecast. This is the last week of the month and we could see significant movement as there will be a monthly close coming up. I'm going to do a complete multi time frame analysis on DXY, British pound, US dollar, Euro dollar, dollar CAD, XAUSD, EN pairs, JPP, JPY, and dollar yen, as well as BTC, USD, and Ethereum, USD. We'll see what kind of opportunity we might have in the upcoming week. So, before I begin this complete analysis, traders, make sure you give a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't done yet for more updated education as well as analysis that i'm posting every single day so without further delay let's get started Okay, so let's begin with first of all DXY starting with the monthly chart again to see overall picture in the market now from the monthly if we look at this is the monthly candle on DXY now as expected this instrument managed to break out completely from the monthly perspective currently the price is above this resistance line let's see we might see uh, this week initial pullback and let's see where we can find potential entry opportunity in this market now this is the monthly candle above this level we might see initial pullback and after that we may see further continuation to the upside if we look at the weekly chart we can see that two weekly stronger wave here one was here and then pullback with a doji followed by another bullish engulfer and we can see that another bullish impulse here on dxy now this is the last week of the month we can see that we could see this upcoming week potential deeper pullback this is the weekly resistance and after this weekly candle what i think that now this week we may see deeper pullback before it bounce back up and the pullback could be to this weekly support level and with that in mind what we can expect on dxy initial drop and then continuation to the upside again at the end of the week now looking at the daily chart now this is the daily trend we can see there is a massive bounce followed by a pullback and the market is maintaining a typical bullish market structure and with that typical bullish market structure we have seen that last um three days of the trading week there was another bounce this is an important support level on dxy and with that support what i think that now as you can see last day of trading week there is a long week candle has been created we might see that the market breaking below for deeper pullback and then continuation to the upside now this could be the situation on dxy and based on that we might see other usd pairs moving in the market so now let's see on gbp usd what kind of trading opportunity we might have looking at the monthly chart again british pound us dollar we can see that back to back two months massive drop and with that drop the market currently below this significant support level as expected in all our analysis and this is the monthly candle is almost closing we might see initial pullback that can give another potential drop in this market if we look at the weekly chart we can see that from the weekly perspective every week there there were red candles so therefore uh, this upcoming week expecting british pound us dollar to bounce back up for deeper pullback and this is the current weekly candle what i think that gbp usd may bounce back up to the resistance and then could continue to drop again to create a new lower low so with that in mind let's look at the daily chart to see how the market might be doing now from the daily perspective on british pound us dollar we can see that this is a, a typical bearish market structure we have seen there is a massive drop followed by a pullback another drop another bounce the market is forming series of lower high and lower low which is a typical downtrending market structure and back to back three days of drop here on british pound us dollar and we might see that uh, in the upcoming days 
potential bounce again this is at a high liquidity zone and i think that before the monthly close we might see a breakout and then potential drop uh, on british pound us dollar now if we look at the four hour time frame we can see that the market already in a downtrend i will be expecting deeper pullback in this market and this could be the situation as the market is is well below the previous support level we might see initial bounce and then continuation to the downside to create a new lower low now let's look at euro dollar let's see what kind of trading opportunity we have in this market looking at the monthly chart on euro dollar we can see that from the monthly this is the monthly uh, candlestick pattern here on euro dollar uh, it's a massive drop on euro dollar and what i think that we might see initial pullback deeper pullback in this market and that give another potential for selling on euro dollar this is the previous important support level we might see a retest of this support before breaking below now if we look at the weekly chart on euro usd we can see that from the weekly this is a weekly drop here there is a massive drop followed by a pullback and we can see three weeks of drop on euro usd and with the drop what we can expect in the upcoming week for the market to bounce back up and then to drop back again to create a new lower low now if we look at the daily chart on euro usd we can see that back to back three days drop last day last week of the trading uh, and and we can expect now a, a bounce in potentially to grab more liquidity from this resistance and then to continue to drop again to create a new lower low now from the intraday perspective from four hour time frame we can see that euro usd currently you can see that it's a massive drop here the price on a, a very important support level expecting euro dollar to bounce back up for deeper pullback potentially grab liquidity and then to continue to drop and i think that we might see initial bounce and then continuation towards the downside on euro dollar to continue to its long-term downtrending direction now let's look at dollar cad let's see what kind of trading opportunity we might have looking at the monthly chart on dollar cad we can see that from the monthly this is the monthly impulse on dollar cad and with that impulse this is the monthly candle so far uh, we can see it's a narrow dodgy formation and i think that we might see another retest of the monthly support uh, with the deeper pullback and then continuation uh, to the upside or after this retest we might see another potential bounce on dollar cad now if we look at the weekly chart on dollar cad we can see that from the weekly this is the weekly impulse here followed by this pullback and you can see another impulse followed by another drop last week we have seen a red candle and with the red candle what we can expect for this market to drop again for deeper pullback and this is the monthly support where there is a an important support level where there is a high liquidity and what i think there on dollar cad we might see another wave of bounce on dollar cad now looking at the daily chart we can see that from the daily perspective on dollar cad is where this is an, a very important bounce here on dollar cad followed by narrow pullback and you can see another bounce deeper pullback and and what we can see here is that this is a, a massive breakout on dollar cad followed by another uh, pullback and what we, we can expect on dollar cad what i think that the price might drop again for another wave that can give potential uh, trading opportunity on dollar cad now looking at the four hour time frame we can see that the market here is in a pullback this is a, a long term uptrending market structure and if we look at this trend line and i think that the market might come back down again for a deeper pullback that can give for the market to grab liquidity and then to bounce back up to create a new higher high that could be the wave on dollar cad in the upcoming week now let's see on xau usd now this instrument was in a very nice trend past week we have seen that there was a, a massive breakout and complete change of trend now i will be doing a full analysis let's look at the monthly chart 
on XAU USD. Now from the monthly, this is a, a massively bull market. Starting from here, we have seen that there is a massive breakout followed by deeper pullback and we can see that another breakout in this market. Now, if we look at the monthly perspective, this is the monthly candle so far. And with that monthly candle, this is a dodgy currently five days remaining for this price to uh, this candle to close as the market is almost approaching the monthly resistance what i think that before the monthly close we might see another retest of this monthly resistance and then we could see potential further drop again in this market now looking at the weekly chart we can see that this is a massive bullish move on the weekly which is uh, as soon as the candle open we have seen this week there was a gap open and complete breakout now the candle is closing what we can expect with the new opening is for the price to have another bounce to retest the monthly resistance and then to drop again at certain level in this direction now looking at the daily chart we can see that as expected xae usd currently in this level where this is the previous support here turning resistance here and with that support turning resistance on xae usd expecting for this market to continue to rise to the level and this is an important uh, daily resistance here where there is a high liquidity and i think that in this upcoming uh, days we might see the price is breaking that high where there is a high liquidity and then to drop back down to create a new lower low now from the four hour time frame on xae usd we can see that this is a a typical uptrending market structure there is a breakout pullback another breakout deeper pullback and we can expect another breakout in this market now from the four hour time frame we can see that there was a, a liquidity candle formation here and which is a sign that the market may continue to rise in the upcoming uh, session with the market open and this is the zone where there is a high liquidity as the price moves from liquidity to liquidity what i think that the price might retest this important liquidity zone and then could continue to drop to that order block as we have seen that once the market break out from this order block it didn't retest that level that could be the way for the upcoming week on xau usd also i will be uh, posting analysis traders make sure you keep eye every day in the channel and also subscribe uh, to the channel for more updated education like this every single day so now let's see gbp jpy to see what kind of opportunity we have now looking at the monthly chart on gj we can see that from the monthly perspective this is the monthly price section on gbp jpy from here there was a massive drop on the monthly to this support level and with that uh, drop what we can see that after quite a few months every month the market was forming series of higher low now this current monthly candle after retesting this resistance started to drop again the market currently in a support level where we can expect a potential bounce again on gbp jpy now looking at the weekly chart on gj we can see that from the weekly perspective the market is forming series of lower high in that area and with that drop on gbp jpy what we can expect for the market to retest this previous resistance which is turning support here and with that uh, drop what i think that this week we might see further continuation and then bounce back up again to create a new higher high now dropping down to the daily chart on gbp jpy what we can see that from the daily this is a daily drop here this is a long term bull market and what we can see from the daily this is an an order block here as we have seen there was a breakdown uh, again the market was trending to the upside with that breakdown and expecting for gj to drop again to retest and then to continue to rise again to create a new higher high now looking at the four hour time frame on gbp jpy what we can see the market this is a, a long consolidation creating series of lower high expecting for this market to drop 
and this is where there is an important support level and i think that gj may initially drop to that monthly support and from that zone we can expect for the market bounce back up to create a new higher high this could be the wave for the upcoming week on gbp jpy now let's look at dollar yen let's see what kind of trading opportunity we have looking at the monthly chart on dollar yen we can see that from the monthly this is the monthly price section on dollar yen and we have seen back to back four months of drop to the support level and with that support what we can see that on dollar yen from the support level expecting it now uh, this there is a bounce this is the monthly candle expecting for the market to reach as the support and then to bounce back up to create a new higher high now looking at the weekly chart on dollar yen we can see that from the weekly perspective this is the weekly bounce here from this level followed by this pullback and back to back three weeks narrow uh, movement and what i think the dollar yen as this week initially we are expecting dollar to drop down i think the dollar yen might drop again to the support level and then could continue to rise again to create a new higher high now looking at the daily chart on dollar yen we can see that from the daily perspective this is the daily uh, bullish market structure on dollar yen there is a bounce pullback the market is forming series of higher high and higher low expecting dollar yen to drop again uh, break to potentially break from the structure and then to continue to rise again to create a new higher high now looking at the four hour time frame on dollar yen we can see that the market trend was uh, currently in a sideway as this is an uptrend the market in a sideway potentially you could see a break of structure and then continuation to the upside now this could be the wave for dollar yen in the upcoming week now let's look at BTC USD. Let's see what kind of trading opportunity we have in this instrument. Now looking at BTC USD, looking at the monthly chart to see overall picture in the market. Now this is the monthly price section. BTC USD almost hitting that 100k level, and we may see that BTC USD is keep pushing high to create a new higher high as it is currently highly volatile and bullish in this market and we may see potential continuation on btc usd now let's look at the weekly chart and we can see that from the weekly perspective after this weekly bullish candle there is uh, quite a few weeks of bull move giving btc usd potential um, bullish momentum in this market and with that impulse what we can expect on btc usd for the market to come for a deeper pullback and then to continue to rise to create a new higher high now looking at the daily chart on btc usd we can see that from the daily perspective this is the daily impulse here on btc usd followed by this pullback and we can see that the market is in another uh, impulsive phase in this market and btc usd what we can see that the market in this uh, movement the the price is moving high and the price you can see is above for daily time frame above 10 ema which is a sign that very strong bullish trend if we look at the four hour chart on btc usd we can see that the market trend is up and with that uptrend expecting for the market to drop again uh, for a deeper pullback and then to continue to rise to create a new higher high now let's look at ethereum usd let's see what kind of opportunity we have in this market now looking at the monthly chart on ethereum usd we can see that from the monthly this is the monthly impulse on ethereum usd and with that monthly impulse we may see that trend continuation in this market now if we look at the weekly chart on ethereum usd you can see that from the weekly this is a bullish market we have seen quite a few weeks of sideway movement a complete breakout pullback and the market is currently trending with a stronger momentum now if we look at the daily chart on ethereum usd we can see that from the daily this is the daily impulse followed by this correction and we can see another impulsive phase ethereum usd and expecting for the market for to come down for a deeper pullback 
and then to continue to rise as it is a long-term bull market now from the intraday perspective on ethereum usd we can see that from the four hour perspective this is an an impulse in this market followed by this pullback and we can see it is in another impulsive phase expecting ethereum usd for the market to uh, break below this uh, structure this is where there is a high liquidity and then to continue to rise. i hope the traders you enjoyed this weekly forex forecast if you enjoyed make sure you give a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't done yet thank you and i'll see you soon in my next analysis